All right, everyone, welcome back. So over the last couple of weeks, we've been talking about early extension, okay? So early extension, again, is when we're set up to the ball, okay? And say I drew a line right behind my back end here, okay? And I went back, and then my hips extend towards the ball, getting my butt, my hips, to go off that line and my spine to stand straight up. And another thing happens is when that happens, when I extend, my chest kind of pulls out to the right, okay? So everything stands up. So I want to uh, talk to you a little bit about some like little stretches and exercises that you can do to really help you stay in your posture. So again, early extension is a lot in the hips. So I'm gonna get you a good routine to fire up those hips, okay? It looks a little goofy, but it'll get you going in good shape, okay? So all I want you to do is put the grip end uh, pointed towards the target and you'll cross your the shaft right across your shoulders. Okay, now get into a golf position. Okay, now what you're gonna do is try and keep that lower, keep the upper body nice and stable and really rotate your hips forward, back, through, back, through, back, through. So looking at it at this angle, keep your upper body nice and stable and just turn, turn, turn. So you're keeping your upper body stable and separating your hips from your upper body getting a little separation. Sometimes what I see players do when they do this is they'll move their upper body with their lower body, causing, causing someone to come in a little steep on the ball and then extend up, right? Causing the ball to either top, uh, go out to the right, or really sling off to the left. So the first step is just to fire up those hips a little bit, okay? And then what I wanna do is, I wanna do another stretch here where I just lay my club down, okay? And all I'll do is set up to the golf ball, stick both of my hands out, and really feel a big stretch in my chest. And you'll see uh, all my weights loaded into my back heel. Okay, and then really I want you to turn your hips and I want you to smack your left hand just like that. So you'll see it impact. My hips are turned about 45 degrees and my shoulders are open about 30 degrees to the target. All right, so again, a big chest turn just like this and then just smack your hand just like this. If you're a little bit of an early extender, here's what's gonna happen. You're gonna go back, big chest turn, extend your hips, and you're gonna miss your left hand, okay? This actually helps if you swing over the top, too, because you go back here, and you get a big chest turn back, and you swing over the top, you don't wanna do that either. So go back, and just go right to your hand, just, just like this. Let's look at it face on here. Okay, big chest turn. Okay, big chest turn. Big chest turn right there, and then just turn through. Okay, one more. It, our W turns, okay? So all I'll do is get into an athletic position stick my hands up, kind of forms a W right there, get into a golf position, coil up that chest back, and then rotate it through, okay? So you get your palms down, okay? Back, so your palms are face right towards the back, just like that, and then you rotate through, and your palms facing down. You can see I rotated my hips and my chest is down, right? If I early extend, I'll go here and then my palms will come up, 
right? Going this way. We want back palms, palms forward. All right, now my hips are fired up. Now they're ready to go, okay? So I'm gonna take a couple practice swings. Feel that big chest turn back. A nice balanced finish. Okay, so set up, look at that target one last time. Okay, let's hit another one. Let's take a rehearsal, just feeling that little hip rotation. Okay, feeling that hip rotation. Yeah, nice balanced finish. Everything pointed towards my target. Nice and balanced. Okay, and now, <clears throat> when you're hitting another really good thing also, are little pauses at impact, okay? So remember, we fired up the hips. We're getting the hips ready. Now let's pause at impact. Watch this. So we're going to go back. Now pause at impact. See my hips turn, chest over the ball, hips rotated uh, 45 degrees, just like this. If I early extend, everything comes up. Stay in that posture, turn, separate those hips. Okay, now you fed it, you fed it with that goodness. Now feel it to a nice balanced finish. All right, I hope this worked out for you. Let me know, email me, uh, just get in touch with me and let's keep this going. All right, thank you, bye.